Hello everybody and welcome back to Mercenary Kings. There's a kitty cat right there. Hello kitty cat. Hello. So I went for a cool factor with my gun this time. Just look how cool that gun looks. There's a giant knife at the end of it. Um, still have the plant-like sight on it. <laughs> it just looks cool though. I don't know if it's as good as my trombone rifle because I mean my trombone rifle is pretty amazing. Um, but we're gonna go on a mission with this new gun. We're gonna go on a rendezvous mission. Engineer of War. An engineer is defecting. Meet, kill, oh, meet, <laughs> meet kill. No, meet him before he gets killed. He also talked about the blueprint of a new type of steel soldier. All right, so probably a new boss we're gonna fight in the future. Let's accept this, thank you. All right, Bobby, let's go. Move out. Watch this weapon totally suck, but it looks cool though, so. Even if it does suck, I'm going to look cool doing it. That's unfortunate. I was hoping like maybe he would do a like a bayonet stab with his rifle. That's not that low damage. Uh-oh. Long reload, though. Alright, let's check the map. Where are we going? We're going right there. Alright, so let's just keep going straight. We'll take the um, above route. And then we'll go um, down under. Apologies to any Australians I just offended by making a very, very bad stereotypical Australian um, accent. But to be fair, the only accent I really have to go on, mostly really, is Crocodile Dundee. Those kind of bad movies they made in the in the 80s, maybe early 90s. I can't even remember. Kill you, kill you. Oh, that's. That is a pallet and some boxes there. Whoa, that just threw in a boomerang? What? Again, with like the um, Mega Man. That's like a Mega Man attack. I mean, look at his arm and he's shooting like a weird projectile. That's cool. I wonder if I can absorb it. Ooh, oh, man. That was almost like a... Um, that reminded me of the old game Doom. The... Well, they like the holders or whatever when they die and they just kind of explode. That's what this death animation reminded me of. That was pretty cool. He died in a cool way. Let's make a jump. Let's kill it. Oh, I can't kill that guy. Alright, where are we in terms of the mission? Alright, it's a little bit further. Let's go kill this fool. Whoa. I want those materials up there. Hey, sir. You know, it's funny, I was just talking about Crocodile Dundee, and I believe his weapon in the movies was a boomerang. And then I see this new enemy type whose weapon is basically a boomerang. A cyber boomerang. Right, let's go in here. The barracks. Can we... Yeah, yeah, okay, so we need to go through here to progress. Long reload speed. I don't like that reload speed. But other than that, this gun looks kick-ass, man. Oh, you're so dead. Alright. Hmm. Down. Let's check out this room. Oh! <laughs> Won't get me, sir. Alright, let's let that wear off, and now you die. Thank you for the aluminum. So, the name of the company that made this game is called Tribute Games, and I can really see why they're named that. Because this this game, I've just seen so many elements of different old school games um, kind of mixed into this one. And maybe not, it's maybe not intentional on the developer's part, but they're there. I'm going to assume that they're intentional. Alright, 
You know, actually, this was a bad way to go. I thought this middle section would go connect. Alright, well, let's just go all the way around then. That's my bad. Did not have proper planning. But we still have six minutes. We're alright. So is this okay? Okay, let's go down here. And jump. <laughs> uh, you poor flame guy. Alright, so we need to go down further. Let's just, just check this room out first. S. Or S? What? Excellent. Word I'm looking for. Just wait for that to pass. There we go. Ah, yes. More of these guys. Thank you for the materials. Where are we going? Uh, a little bit further. Ah! There you go. Oh yeah, I've been down here before. Is this up here? Yeah, up here. Oh, no, 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 there we go. Alright. <laughs> Hello, engineer person. I'm here to rescue you. Ah, let's get whatever this is. Yeah, ration. See, so yeah, the gun's not too bad. I think it... It passed the test trials. Apologies if you hear the dog. He makes a lot of um, appearances in my videos. Um, yeah, so let me. T oh, I'll get to that later. Here. Kings, Lawless, and Ironside have decrypted the previously found schematics. Claw is. <laughs> I don't know why I said it that way. Uh, come on, Choppy. Tone down the language. Oh, he was. He was cussing up a storm. You gotta excuse choppy, salty language, guys. The guy's just steamed because Claw has been using us as target practice. Not just any regular le uh, lead, but some serious fireballs and lightning coming from down there. I just realized he's actually talking about the helicopter and not the pilot. The pilot's name is Bobby. The chopper name is... Oh my god, the chopper was talking to us. Oh, this game. Alright. Mother... <laughs> uh, him. As I was saying. Claw is creating stronger weapons, wielding elemental ammo. Why is the chopper talking to us? Weapons with chemical payloads, electrical beams. Lawless can also build you some, but be careful. Claw's troops are more dangerous than they've ever been. Is that right, Mr. Colonel Man? Kitty cat! Alright, do we have any money? To build more parts? Like a different sight? Like a canine interceptor or a flushing? Uh, what does this do for us? Just increases the accuracy. That's not that important. Only life important. Fire starter. But I am looking. I'm going for the coolness look. That's cool. Um, what other receivers can we get? Oh, that has like a little skull on it. Or nothing. What is, is that? Like a space invader? That's also cool. Very expensive. Uh, we can just, I guess we can just stick with this. This, this. We just got it. Let's get a different magazine, though. Um, or can we get a different freedom fighter? Scan rifle. Look at that reload time, man. It's in the negatives? Is that just minus what we are right now, or? I don't know. But this has 20 bullets. So let's do that one. Oh, you know, I totally forgot about ammunition. And we cannot afford any of that. Okay. Okay. Let's just take on another mission, then. Alright, I was going to tell you about the dog. Uh, well, hold on. Let's get a mission here. Infiltration mission. Sure. 
Uh, Claw's engineer went back to his room in Skyscraper A17 and got in trouble. Bring him back. Do we have to capture him? It didn't say capture, so I don't think we'll need a shock grenade. You know what? Let's. Oh, there he is again. Um. Now he's distracting me. Let's get another shock bomb. Put it in our backpack. And let's get another first aid. And put... wait, supply box. What? All oh, right, the rations are there. Okay. Um. There it is. There it is. So anyway, uh, this dog, he looks out of a window into a, the backyard here, and whenever he sees an animal or like any kind of human being anywhere in other homes around the area, he just he just loses his shit. So that's why you probably hear him all the time. I can't prevent him from doing that. All right, so let's start the mission. And with this uh, newer mic that I have, it probably picks it up even more than my old one did. So I do apologize for the dog, but he's crazy. Like, I can't help it. Alright, where are we going here? Oh, yeah, right, skyscraper. Okay, so let's go down the right side. We need C4 for that then, don't we? Whoa. Oh, man. Where was the C4? It's in one of the rooms on the left side. Okay. Let's make sure there's none in here. Damn it. I'm ill equipped for this mission. go all the way down the left side to get to the C4 room. I remember there was C4, um, and I think there's even a person protecting it. Does this go... yeah, this goes down. Steel. Man, there must be really someone back there. There goes your head, buddy. Apologies. But you're in my way. I wonder if that room at C4. Nope. It has nothing. Wow, that didn't even have any materials? What a chip, dude. And I really don't think I need any more lead. Alright, so that's where the door is. So we need to get some C4 for this door up here. No problem. No! Down! Down elevator. Where's the next room? Okay, so on this level. I think there's gonna be any C4 in this box. I think there's gonna be red boxes specifically. Ooh, stainless steel. You don't have many of those yet. Oh no, I just run into it. No. Oh, the fire it hurts. It hurts. Oh, that's not destroyed. Oh, that's a ration. Dang. It's over there. All right, we gotta go back up. You already respawned? Oh my god, dude. I just left that, that part of the... You already Where are they getting all these guys from? Down. Ooh. Hold on. There it is. I think this is it. Yep. Okay, so let us... Let's... Use the first aid and then ditch the other one. There we go. Now I gotta go back up. I'll do my elevator summoning dance. Haha! <laughs> Works every time. Oh, that. Piece of crap. Ooh. But 
Rusty Bolt. Do my summoning dance. There it is. Let's go up. Ascend! Ascend! No! Come back! Yes! Now go up! It's, it's... Alright, where are we going? Oh, right, right through here. Alright, let's get out the C4. Plant that. And fire in the hole! He's up a little bit. Alright, so we go this way. Um. So the reason why I didn't drop my shock bombs is because I didn't know if we would need to shock this guy. No, 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 no! I didn't want to get hit. I got scared. I pull out. <gasps> oh, man. Blade Igniter. Dude. I'm going to be bringing back a corpse. Oh, you poor bastard. Man, he just he got lit, lit up. Um. All right, let's buy some more first aid in the backpack. Thank you. Let's go on another mission. This is a capture mission. Mission flame on. Capture an incendiary steel soldier. Oh gosh. Uh, yeah, we can take that mission. So I should already have... How do I check my... Alright, we can just... Yeah, I have shock bombs. Okay. Probably gonna need those for this, since it's a capture mission. Move out! No problem. I've captured a steel soldier before. How worse could an incendiary steel soldier be? Alright, so he's gonna be at one of the... Boss locations. Okay, let's go straight. Oh wow, one bullet didn't, didn't kill him. <laughs> That's still satisfying. <laughs> uh, it doesn't make sense why their heads pop up like a balloon and explode, but it uh, still looks cool though. I do not need lead, so there's no point in going up there. I don't know why I did that. I could've just jumped over that little barricade. I just wanted to be cooler. There it is. Alright, so let's see if the boss is up here. He is not. Okay. Well, let's check up here then. Because it's pretty close. Come on, spiders. Ah, oh, crap. Alright, so he is way back underground then. I chose the wrong spot. So he's, yeah, off to the right. The 
thing is, the screen was shaking up there, though. Oh! Aw, oh, you... Prick. There he is! Alright, let's reload. He was somehow already activated. Oh, my roll wasn't fast enough. All right, now we can capture him. Wrong one. There it is. So, he didn't actually have any flame attacks or anything. He was just a steel soldier. Like, well, that wasn't anything. Oh, well. Fellas, I'm hearing and seeing things. Claw is on the move. Claw is using steel soldiers to regroup and carry out materials and weapons outside of the city. The resistance and our operation are making it harder to run things smoothly in there. Kings, I've just got word from the resistance. A member with top secret documents has been taken by Claw. The documents detail the exact location of Commander Baron's city command center. It's imperative we find those plans and blast Baron out of the city. All right. So, that's going to do it for this episode. On the next episode, I guess we can expect to find some plans and then blast the Baron out of the city. So, thanks for watching this episode, everybody, and I will see you next time.